New at five, the city of New Orleans has started the first phase of its plan to get the homeless adults off the streets, mostly adults. Today, the city shut down one of the biggest homeless encampments, the one under the bridge on Chapatulis. WGNO's Ashley Hamilton has been talking to business owners around there. Ashley. Susie, this is only the start of the city's goal to decrease homelessness along the streets of New Orleans. Business owners are happy about the news, but also want to make sure the city has a plan for the homeless. The city of New Orleans has finally begun clearing out the homeless encampments along Chapatula Street that have plagued the city for years. Business owners say the encampments leave customers hesitant. And they've been migrating from Chapatula's in St. Charles area um, down this way, so I've been seeing a couple of new faces. When we have customers, sometimes they're a little nervous. Um, a lot of times they try to seek shelter here if it's raining, so that could be a little awkward. Owners tell WGNO they hope this will boost businesses tremendously. However, they hope the city keeps its promise they'll properly find housing for the homeless. As long as they have somewhere for them to go, it's, it's, it's really helpful on both ends. It's helpful for us as business owners, so it's going to be helpful for them, for them to get them off the streets. I'm feeling good about it. I'm especially happy that they'll be getting proper housing um, and the mental services or things that they need. I think this will be great for our business. It'll keep things clean, the trash. Once cleared, a portion of the encampment will be temporarily fenced and patrolled to prevent new settlers. However, in the back of her mind, Barry could see potential homeless encampments returning. With the mission being so close by and just the state of our economy with homelessness, um, we may get some people away, but we see new people here like every month. We may not be able to resolve it right away. The city does not plan to give the location of the subsidized apartments, but have said that it is located in the city's inner core. Susie? Some really empathetic uh, business owners there that you talked to. We'll have to see if some of the homeless people do come back. Thanks, Ashley.